Hello everyone, I'm Tabitha Roberts. Today I'm going to show you how to contour your nose so that it looks smaller. Almost like a temporary nose job, you know, but with makeup. No surgery, no knives, no nothing. Just makeup and a few minutes. So, let's get started. I'm using a MAC concealer, it's Studio Fix. 24 hours it's supposed to last 24 hours so I'm just going to put this under my eyes it's like this really Now I'm going to do the next side. And of course we have to put some down the middle. Okay, so I'm going to leave this to just set a bit. And uh, then we're going to blend it in with a, with a sponge or with a beauty blender. I have a sponge, I like to use these little triangles, I know. It's brown, there's makeup on it, but it works. I love these little things. Okay, so blending it out, let's start. If you don't have a sponge or beauty blender, you can just use your, you can use a brush as well. I like the sponge because you can get into the little areas. Do you know what I mean? Okay, so you're trying to blend that out as much as possible. Mm. I'm going to make this big nose, well it's not actually big, it's, it's pretty average I think, normal size, but we're going to make this nose look smaller, because everyone wants their nose smaller, even if it's not big. Okay, so that is the start of it. The next step that I do is I'm going to take this wrong, it's a lip liner. Uh, you can also use like an eyebrow pencil if you want, as long as it's uh, dark. And uh, what I'm going to do is, this is very very odd, but look, use a pencil and draw a line. Right here. How does that look? Is that scary? <laughs> okay, next side. Right under the brows. You're drawing it from under the brows. And right in that crease where you left out before. The part you didn't put any concealer on. That's where you're putting this pencil right now. Oh my. 
Made a little uh, mistake here. here. Just gonna have no fear, have no fear. We're going to blend that out. So I'm just get a little more concealer to fix that mistake. It is okay to make mistakes. Okay. Okay, so here I am with the pencil again. I'm just going to put that in. You're probably wondering, okay, so are you just going to leave these two lines on your nose? And the answer is no, I'm not leaving these two lines on my nose. I'm going to blend it out. How are you going to blend it out? I'm going to use this brush. And I'm going to blend it out. So it's not so sharp and obvious. This is a slanted eyebrow brush. I like to use it because it kind of, you know, it's kind of precise in a way. So you blend that out. Now I'm blending this part out. Blend, blend, blend. Smudge, smudge, smudge. Good. Okay, now what? Now what to do? Hmm. Now, you're almost done. I told you this was very easy and fast and simple. You don't have to spend forever trying to make your nose look smaller. Okay, so the next step, I would go in with a little more concealer. Just put a little, like right here, right here. Okay. And just sort of clean it up a bit. Probably thinking, oh, that's a lot of work. It's not a lot of work. The next thing I'm going to do is use some setting powder to just set this in place. And then some highlighter, and that's pretty much the end of it. I'm telling you all, when you do this, I really want you to send me your pictures of before and after. To the before, before you even start putting on makeup. Or you can take the before picture right after you put on some foundation. After you put on some foundation, you can just take that picture. Before picture. After you contour your nose, then you can take the after picture and just send me a picture. I want to see your lovely work. Okay, so this is pretty much this right here. You can go back in with the brush if you feel you need to. Make sure there are no harsh lines. You don't want the harsh line, okay? You really don't. You can blend out the line right here in the center. You 
Now, setting powder. I'm using the Sasha Buttercup setting powder. And I'm just going to put it on. Using the same sponge, just like clean that a little bit, put some here. I really like the setting powder, it really kind of keeps everything in place. Exactly what you want. Okay, so I'm going to leave this for a little while and uh, in the meantime, what can I do? Maybe just some mascara. I actually don't like mascara at all, but I wear it because I think it's necessary. I also don't like eyelash extensions, but I also think that's necessary. I just don't have any on right now. I barely wear them. Something I think I need to do more often. But because I don't like them and I'm mostly just home all the time. I'm going on vacation soon, so I may put some in. Okay, now. Now I'm going to dust off this setting powder with this brush and that's the end of it. Highlighter and done. Okay, I use this highlighter. It's by MAC. It's called Glow With It. Extra Dimension Skin Finish. I love this. I recently got this. And I'm going to apply it with this brush. It's a highlighter brush. Also from MAC. And I'm just doing this. like, And you can just put some down the middle. There. Of course, I also put some here. Not too much. You have to put everything in moderation. Hmm. And that is how to contour your nose to fake a nose job, to make your nose smaller if you feel like making it smaller that day, or just to polish up your overall makeup look. I hope you like this tutorial. Let me know and send me pictures of your contoured noses. Bye!